communicate, right? Now, now that don't make the not a real nigga. It might just be a nigga lack communication. Why can't you? Why? Why you can't communicate with a nigga, homie? Tell you though, that's you, and that's solid to the core. But the thing about this game that you're in now, is no morals in. You right. I'm not, I'm not living like that. I ain't scared of that. What you gonna kill me? Cause I say I don't want to do it. And but you got something, bro. This is how you activate. Nah, this how you activate. real with you, but but let me keep it real with you. That's what I'm gonna deal with. Niggas call me to do my shit. They, but that's what I'm telling you. These calling me. This what make it. This what make. I ain't calling no. Cold, it's cold right now. That's what I'm telling you. I don't never hear the about nothing. Did you call me and you try to pull some kind of what is but at the end of the day though bro this is a and then this hit, ain't listen. the game of real oh, but I'm this saying, is if dedicate all of us will have a billion dollars already yeah but That's these what I'm but this is the game of suckers if was out here getting money and a with broke taking money we look at them it's different like, like, like now nah, the they take they take your money don't got no no business speaking on the brick price he don't got no business talking about what the hustler everyday life is. And that's the thing in this podcast game. Even if I do look at him and say, yeah. man, what the doing? Why he even talking about robbing and he ain't never took nothing? Yeah. Man, yeah. He called you and said whatever he said. Your first initiative was he was a sucker. Yes. Before y'all even had to come say yes. before he said he wanted yes. to say he, So when he say he wanted to do it. I don't know that this is a sucker. Yeah, yeah, that uh, you right about yeah, that. Been that you right. <laughs>
I said, boy, I'm playing a pretty penny for a nigga to hit record and disappear. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It ain't the money. So for me, bro, I had to, uh, I had to, I had to figure it all out, man. I just, it was just important, bro. Well, I could dig. With the amp shit, man. Talk to me about that. I think that was a, that's a big move for you. Oh nah, it was uh, shout out to Kenny Byrne. He called me one day. They had a, um, they were doing an actual uh, project called a come up where they picked three artists and uh, like five influencers and DJs from Atlanta vouch for them. So it was me, Sue Solo, Paige, DJ Cash, and um, and Kenny Burns. So they. Um, they, they 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 highlighted three artists, uh, Pope Baby, CEO Trill, and Ken Carson. And uh, my dude Cam Kurt, he shot he shot like uh, visuals on us and on them talking. So it was like a 90 day um, shit we did called uh, the come up, just highlight artists. But the app itself, I be on that shit all the time. I fuck with it. You can play music, you know. Say so I create a relationship with them folks. I think we're gonna move forward and do something else after this come up thing but yeah i'm on now yeah i can appreciate that man like for us to have those opportunities is important i think kenny burns is someone that i, I heard his name mentioned like, a few times about being like instrumental in moves like that oh yeah for sure you know what i'm saying and i think it's important that we highlight even people like that so it's good to see you say that when, when i look at atl man alana it's the home of this shit, man. Like, how you think Atlanta snatched the music game? Oh, uh, shit! Shit about being Atlanta niggas, bro. I don't know. I don't know how this. I don't know how to put it without sounding like we the shit. But yeah, but you know what I'm saying. I'm just being real. But you kind of had to. Shit, yeah, but you kind of had to be special, right? Because New York, up north, not even just New York, but up north, sound. Had like a hold on music, like a very, very like chokehold. And Coast had, his, had they yeah, too. but but when we took it, we took it from from the north. We, when we seen Juvie drop high, we see Jay Z have to come get on that song. We see Jay Z have to go get on that Pimp C song. You know, certain moves kind of started to get us. It was little by little by little by little, and then I just think Atlanta just came in and snatched it. I yeah. think it was had a little motion, and then Atlanta came in and just just grabbed it, man. I don't know how it happened. I be wanting to ask niggas from the A, like, because y'all saw it happen. I'm like, how the fuck did, like. Man, them niggas oh. just talking that shit. <laughs> Tip, Tip was talking that shit. You know what I'm saying? Tip came in talking that shit, then Jeezy, uh, Gucci, for sure. Gucci, man, it just was like so many niggas. That sound the same, but not the same. You get what I'm saying? Like Atlanta, I guess, like when you, some kind of way, when you look in them other cities, when they had it, like everybody, like that's a New York nigga, or that's a California nigga. Atlanta, when you come to Atlanta, all these niggas sound the same and look the same and talk the same, but these niggas are different kind of niggas. It's a it's spectrum. Like, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, but I, I guess you probably can tell when you from New York, you can tell when. A niggas a Brooklyn nigga, a niggas a Bronx nigga. No, so right, yeah, we can't prim. tell the difference. Yeah, yeah, just a New York nigga. Exactly, we yeah, can't tell the difference. Yeah. In Atlanta, if you from somewhere, you can see that this is a different nigga than that, that nigga that they saying from Atlanta. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a spectrum like of niggas. T.I., Future, Lil Baby, um, 21 Savage, Nudie, just all the rappers, you name all the rappers, they all different niggas. Sure, yeah. But they all from the A. Exactly. But they all represent different shit from Atlanta. But that's how a nigga take over the game. Yes. Because they were stuck with you uh, like a format. They put a format on yes. the hustle. Everybody came out doing they damn near their own in, thing. In the South. Different niggas. Yeah. Like we different kind of niggas. Yeah. We, we didn't put no, no, one, no rules on the hustle. Exactly. Yeah. We saying, yo, if you popping drug dealing, if you popping drug taking. If you popping partying, if you popping pimp shit, exactly, right? It's it, we whatever you doing. If it hustling, it sound right. We fucking with it. Exactly. That shit was crazy. That shit crazy, man. That shit crazy. Um, you still you still enjoy podcasting? How you feel about podcasting? Podcast? Feel like you know, no, for, for me, me like now that's sitting like, for. I'm just keep saying like that shit began to be therapy. Like when I started fucking with the podcast, it started make me think because I'm starting to get. Different people opinions and different people outlooks and started really taking them in. 
You know what I'm saying? When you in the streets or whatever, you 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 feel like you done mastered that shit. You nigga can't tell you shit. Not no niggas who ain't like you say ain't getting no money. Nigga right. got them. If you ain't at the top of this shit, I really don't want to hit this. Nigga shit. ain't hear me. I want to hear this shit from the niggas who feel like the Jays and shit. Who so I can see I cause niggas just want to learn the dudes. You gotta learn the dudes and the don't. Mm. And you can't talk to a nigga on how to lose when he ain't never lost. I want to talk to a nigga who lost it all. Man. Yeah, because that's how you get the information. Yeah. Without the loss, you don't know nothing. Exactly. If you've been winning so long, it's almost like even when them athletes, you'll see them, or even when somebody runs into success too early, right? You see them, a child celebrity or a child star. You'll see them get older and almost lost. fall apart. Be lost. Yeah, yeah, because yeah. you got it too early and you ain't never lost. Mm-hmm. So when you finally run into that loss as an adult, you don't know how to handle that. Yeah, yeah. And losing is a part of winning. Yeah, yeah. People don't the, know that. The, 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 shit, that's the first part. Before you win, you're going to lose. Yeah. Time. yeah, everything. Yeah, shit. Yeah, I think... Um, we was talking about getting guests in podcasting and the way I've been able to do it, sometimes I do a lot of pods by myself, but but getting the guest thing is is what the almost every young podcaster stopped me and asked me about. But them niggas can't, man, listen, man. It's just like life. I don't want to talk. No nigga don't want to talk. Facts. Fuck you. Facts. Fuck this broadcast. And fuck you and everything you stand for. So, neither that nigga got to reach out to us. Yeah. He like, bang, they chop it. Yeah. And they get on with them. You're tired. Because you see what we're doing. We see what you're doing. Right. You know what I'm saying? And that's how I am. Don't you all know, but say niggas, we turn out. We reject niggas. Yeah. You that nigga got to be like, I got to be like, I want, I want, I want, talk to you in real life to talk to you on the podcast. That's how I am. Being real. That's how I am And you know Sometimes they get that confused Because there is a business element to this Right So At some point For you to grow the platform We may have to speak to people We don't agree with We we may not Even see the same Share the same insights with Right Like me I had a CIA guy on You know what I'm saying What that does for the podcast Is it breaks me into a totally different audience That's different that's different what you're yeah. saying. That, nigga, you because you can actually hear what these how these folk you can get the inside from these types. Right, you right. Talking like, you talking about celebrities, niggas, yeah, 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 celebrities, yeah, 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 niggas, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, you you know niggas, yeah. Like, fuck yeah, these niggas, yeah, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck my you niggas. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. I don't talk to a goddamn herbalist or whatever. I don't care. I want information. Yes. You get what I'm saying? Yes. Like, I ain't no trying to get no nigga on the podcast, stir up, and ask you about your beef. Right. Hey, tell us, tell these young niggas how you how you shift. And turn this shit into what you turn it into. Right, right, right. Sometimes we'll see them go where the beef and shit is being served, though. And then not, kind of not give to, because the information helps other niggas get in, yes. man. I be thinking people scared to let other niggas in. I be thinking sometimes they may not want to speak about the information side of this shit. Maybe I don't want to hear it. How you do it. Yeah, like, like how you really do this shit. Like, like what mindset you was in. Yeah, like, yeah. Mindset. How you break out of that to this? Yes, what yes. what happened? Yes. You know what I'm saying? Because that's the conversations I like to have. I don't yeah, even talk music for real. Yeah, yeah, it be a rapper sitting next to me. We don't even go to the yeah, album. Yeah, shit. That's what people need to hear the real. I'm fucking with mindset, huh? Yeah. That what this part. It be about mindset. You know what I mean? When did you switch your mindset? We saw you do a shift in mindset. When did that shit. happen? Start fuck with a podcast Yeah At first you know what I'm saying Nigga was still you know But just listening And talking And getting around certain people And doing certain shit That shit will shift your ass Spiritual, mentally Physically All that shit You just gotta find a purpose bro Nigga don't find a purpose Nigga don't give a fuck Nigga ready to go out bad Fuck that shit Every That's time That's how nigga be like Bang um, Like You know how when you speak From like you get a nigga that, That's kind of A sense of ignorance To different niggas that don't get certain yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. Like, so if I can if I can understand why a nigga doing bullshit to me, to niggas, up some bullshit. But no, I can understand the mindset of a nigga who fucked up, that don't care, that already made their mind up, man, fuck that shit. Yeah. Only way we're gonna be able to teach them is show them that a nigga who had their mind made up, fuck that shit, can change. That's the only way it's gonna preach work. it to a nigga. Nah. You gotta actually see it. And feel it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. But I think that was our generation when you start seeing niggas like 
Gucci, if you see him, never like Gucci can actually change his life and do what he do. If you know this nigga, you know you can change your mother. Yeah, you know, for sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cause you saw him do it. Yes. That's the even better thing. That's why we gotta, yeah, we gotta document the process, man, because that's, that's where the information, information is. It ain't new. We had accepting the award. Everybody show up then. It's the process where I learned through the thing. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? How did Gucci get from Cause we saw him on some other shit. Yeah. Then we saw him go in and come out on some other shit. Mm -hmm. So it's like we saw that. Like I think with him, what do you think about rappers? Like top five. Who who would you say was outside with you? Like the rap niggas you really was outside with? Tomorrow in Atlanta. Yeah, in Atlanta. You know, shit. Who I say just outside? Like yeah. they doing what they say. They yeah, doing. yeah, type thing. Cause they weren't with me, but right. I was just and when I say me. with you, I mean just we know. Like, I know like y'all over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You out right. north with it. I'm out here, but I know you really come from that. Yeah, Gucci for sure. He come yeah. from that. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm gonna stay in the seat. Future. Um, who else? Savage for sure. Nudie. Lil Baby for show. He comes from what he said he comes from yeah. for show. Um who else? Two Chain. Two Chain, he who he say he is. Yeah. Uh, but it's it's a lot of cap. But they ain't I ain't, ain't gonna say that they are all the same type niggas. Some nah. niggas just hustlers. Some nigga tip, Jesus. All these niggas Rocco for show. Yeah, shut up, Rocco. A lot of these niggas, all these niggas who they say they to me. Most of the from Atlanta. You damn near who they say they is. That's funny. That's, That's funny. I'm gonna say that. I'm yeah. gonna say that because in the day, you don't see the niggas. The niggas who is hustling saying that they were hustling. Right. They ain't capping and saying they killing. They ain't capping. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Killing ain't cool, no way. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. The niggas who were taking or finessing. It's the That's what they saying, right? Yeah. Some niggas just did all that, you yeah. know what I'm saying? But in the streets, you look just cause you just say there's a nigga that hustle. He look at a nigga who take as a fuck. Nigga. Yeah, a nigga that take look at a nigga who only hustle as a soft. Yes, you get what I'm saying. Yes. So we can say a nigga a nigga who just say things all just only hustle. Yeah. And I look at niggas who take like, oh, them niggas want to really say them niggas want to get no money because right, they were taking money. Right, right, so that's so what that's, that's what the that's what the, the the he ain't he ain't really like yeah, it. Yeah, because from. he ain't like me. Yeah, he ain't hustle like me. Yeah. He ain't take nothing like exactly. me, so he, he ain't. He nigga been yeah. in the street, took the same chance and did the same shit. Right, he don't gotta be doing what you did. They need to understand that's that. the misconception. That's the misconception. They think because a nigga was a robber, I'm t a robber talking about a hustler saying I ain't who I say I was and I ain't hard cold like that. Yeah. Cause yeah. I wasn't robbing. Or a nigga was poor than you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got some nigga who poor as fuck. Man. So when them niggas make and it out. And ugly. So yeah, so when them poor niggas. Poor and ugly. Them niggas like that make it out, they feel like, boy, them niggas ain't been through what I've been yeah. through. Them I don't niggas like ain't like that. that. Yeah, I don't like it. Yeah, you can't be like that, though, cause you can't say that. Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? Nigga feel like, bro, cause them niggas ain't, them niggas ain't get it how we got it. That they ain't like that. You can't say. Come that. on, family. You can't say Cause that. you were dead broke. We all was in the hood, my nigga. You know that's the realest nigga. D, they the poorest nigga. That's fucked the up. The nigga who feel like they the poorest. I'm the realest. Cause I'm going through. You know what that shit saying? crazy. That's a disease, but man. That's what's going on. I know it. The poorest nigga is think he the realest. Nigga. And, and, and if, if you, you stay, stay poor long enough, you a gangster. You really a gangster if you stayed poor down there and you don't want nothing. But you got hustle that feel like, bro, if you don't know how to get no money, you ain't need no man. Yeah. You ain't to me. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So at the end of the day, it's, it's like a, it's like, that's the division. Because a nigga who know how to get some money, a nigga who refuse to make, uh, make excuses, he look like this. Ah, oh, them niggas are pussy because they got their mind right. You can start working out, nigga be like, look at these lame man, nigga trying yeah, to work out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That you shit fucked bank, up. Bank trying to lose weight and take his goals out. What yeah. kind of nigga? You, nigga yeah. take that for soft. Yeah, yeah. Cause you want better for yourself. You want to live. You don't want to the opposite default. Told you borderline everything. Your ass about to check out if you don't do this shit. So when you try to get healthy, nigga say, look at this nigga want to be healthy. Now. Do you feel that though? Do you feel? Do you? Do you? Is that something you been going through? Do what? you feel that energy out there? No. Yeah. Cause I ain't even going where that energy at, bro. Nigga don't. But think about it, bro. You gotta take keep yourself away from shit you know will bring you to the nigga you don't wanna be. You know what I'm saying? That's why why you see certain niggas when we talking about earlier, 
that don't come around and don't go in different mixes because they know them. It ain't for me. It's for you. Yes. You know what I'm saying? And yes. then when I when I do some shit or be in a situation that I'm saying I'm no longer want to be, that make that contradicts everything I done did. So you know you you know what trigger you? Why go around these niggas? Right. Why deal with these kind of bitches? Right. You know this shit triggers you. Right. But you know it's out there that niggas just got that kind of energy towards the kind of change. Because they know me. Yeah. They, where they knew me. Yeah. A motherfucker that knew you, they gon' they not gonna understand some. You trying to do something else, bro. That's just how this shit. Yeah. Go. That's how it go. Yeah. You know what I'm saying at first you ain't gonna understand until you see like uh, cause. One thing about it, we doubt shit in the beginning anyway. I'm what the same kind of way yeah, yeah. with niggas. Right, like, yeah. uh, we're going to see how long they yeah. do this shit. Yeah. A nigga actually do it, I can accept it like that. He did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We like that. Because we don't believe shit, bro. As niggas. We, do, we ain't having no faith. We ain't having no real faith. Yeah. We ain't having no real faith, dog. Because we done been through hell. But I think that's the same syndrome. It's like survival. You know what I mean? When niggas think... They survive being poor. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I don't know, it's almost like the oppression Olympics where niggas looking at each other. Like, I, I, that's a really good thing you said. Where well, that's a nigga, nigga, but with that, niggas try to think a nigga owe them something for where they come from. Yeah. It's all mindset, bro. You can keep your mind right there or jump your ass over here. Right. That's all it is. Right. And I don't mix and blend with that kind of shit. I don't mix and blend with the mindset that lives in that place, right? That, that even lives in that. Struggle makes me the best thing popping mindset. Like I'm trying to learn shit. You seen that in this in my ear? That's a book plan. Facts. That's what I'm on all Facts. day. I'm I'm high consumption. I'm always taking information in. That's the only how I can stay on this path. Just think about it like this one, right? That's how I look at it. This what made me start feeling like I need to shift because you got different podcasts that listen to us, and we sound so ignorant to these niggas. Just cause of how 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 our um how we comprehend, how right? We send out this articulate, shit, how we yeah, articu yeah, articulate yeah. How you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So niggas look at that shit as as ignorance. Yeah. I ain't even talking to y'all put saying niggas anyway. This is ain't even for you. To, yeah, this ain't even yeah. for y'all. This for the niggas who resonate with this. Right. But I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get some of that shit so I can help these niggas. Shift over to exactly. You get what I'm exactly. Saying? I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go get it, but I gotta say it in a way that they understand it where they at. Right, they right. Not finna understand me talking like the rest of this. Nah, shit. man. And then and you put me in a trick bag if you want me to live talking like that, cause I can't elevate and I can't evolve. This is a mission we on, man. Like Deion Sanders, he's on the cr people critical of him for moving. Some clapping and cheering. I'm on the side to clap and cheer, cause I'm saying he on a personal mission as well as a mission. For the for the boys and shit, there's a thing happening. Man, there's something special happening. Dion doing what he doing because that's what he's supposed to. That's what I'm you saying. Worry about the people week. be bullshitting and couple years this nigga gonna be in the NFL coaching that boy. I believe that him and his boys on the same squad. <laughs> I think said. that's his mission. What else? Right. I came up from goddamn from little uh from from Pee Wee with these boys, man. That what this is. Yeah, and then it's the and then what people need to understand about business is the intangibles that he's now showing. Right, which is not only do I bring you a good product on the field, what happens when I come to your team, man, the, the, the celebrities come, the tickets sell out, the this moves, the that moves. So there's a different level of inspiration moving with that guy. Man, what? You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm you fucking with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, I'm fucking with that. I'm fucking with that. I get something from that. I remember... Uh, and shout out to baby man. I remember you you played that That's my dog song a whole lot when that motherfucker first dropped at oh, one yeah. of them parties. Oh yeah, for sure. Was that well, and it's a number of songs you were playing, but is was that like a was that like a conscious thing or is that just I like this? Are you trying to break the song when you do stuff like that? For sure. Nah, no, I was at um the crazy part about it when that nigga dropped the song. We was on a big ranking tour together. Me and Baby was out there, two niggas from Atlanta, but we on that were like, it was a whole bunch of artists, man. It's like, but from different towns. But he was from Atlanta, I was from Atlanta. So he was on there, he was young, like, hadn't, you know, had just dropped the, uh, the first, uh, what was it, Hard and Hard, the first one? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Like mixtape, no, I forgot what it, My Turn or something, I don't know. Nah, it was what the, his first mixtape I forgot was. what the name was, let's look it up. Hard and Hard or something, whatever it, it his was first mixtape yeah, yeah, was. Uh, yeah, it was one of them ones, he though. He was on the, he was doing the, um, what do you call it? 
uh, promo tour. Promo tour with Bigger Rankin. Yeah. Right time. Remember, shout out to Bigger Rankin. Bigger shout Rankin out Bigger Rankin. He'd run you yeah. through these towns and shit. Like, get you found with the DJs. Yeah. So while we was out there, baby dropped that, my dog, while we was out there. Yeah. I heard that. We're like, we're, like, we're going to leave. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cause he, he was working at Option Song that time. Money is the only fucking option. Yeah, yeah. That shit was hard too. Yeah, yeah. When he dropped that, my dog it was just a different feeling. So right after that, I had um the show. So we playing that shit like. And nah, I have always been a fan of Baby. Like I just they won an award. Yeah, they were screenshots and shit. That this shit was when he first dropped his first sheet. And when he screenshot my coming and sent it to me like. Child, you got it in your eyes. You're going to be one of the world. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. That, I be telling him every time, man. You, I, I heard he be knowing. He know that. I hope he be knowing. Like, you you at the top of the hill, homie. Nah, for sure. Like, when he come to this shit right here, bro, you done done so many different. And he be so humble with it. Yeah. He help his people and yeah. shit. That shit, uh, it's a different. That whole team over there be helping. Oh, nah, for sure. That you whole say, shit, like, it's a different you. thing over there. They going to hit you like, uh, we, do, we dropping. What we doing? Yeah. Big fat. They do it. That's you know what, what I'm saying. saying. They gonna hit a nigga because they know. The thing about it is, it's the difference between niggas who know, niggas who actually hustle and got money. Exactly. You know how to extend yourself because this ain't gonna hurt my pocket. Man. This ain't gonna do nothing but continue to help. That's what, what I'm, I'm saying. Pushing out is what I'm gonna get. Exactly. And then when, like, even when he, them niggas, them niggas really broke me in the podcast space. And what you gotta think about, he didn't, them niggas don't get nothing for that. Nah, fact. That's literally love. That's just, yo, that's real nigga shit. People don't nah, even. Them niggas understand the law of gravity, bro. Yeah. The law of attraction. What you put out is what you get, man. Yeah, that's you every time. That's it, bro. Niggas, yeah. niggas, niggas, been getting, niggas been getting money a long time doing some other shit. Niggas, niggas over there around them niggas. And you can period. tell it in a nigga texture, right? Yes. A nigga, that's why I was telling, I did Earn Your Leisure yesterday. And I was telling them the reason why why podcasters and black business people a lot of time, in particular rappers that that came from somewhere else and maybe didn't make as much as they needed to, now they show up somewhere else and do something and they start working. I think it gets scarce for them, man. I think they're actually like, all right, this is my chance to save the family. I've been bullshitting 20 years with the rap shit. Take everything in. So I think they have a different relationship with opportunity. But you got but think about it, bro. Any nigga who how they is, that's how they gonna be when they go and get the real money. Like these niggas, niggas, certain niggas already have mindset of that. I already was doing that. The money just being enough so I can do it for a whole That's people. what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? And you that's gotta, how you can tell that in a nigga moves, you gotta though. You got to be a hell of a nigga to be able to go through all the burns, though. Because niggas still getting burnt. Yeah, with this nigga heart. fuck you, man. You go man. through all these burns and still have a good heart. But that's a hell of a nigga. Yeah, because they going to do you wrong. Oh, Real niggas sure. get done wrong. And you got to take it on the chin. Because if you say something, they gonna, they even they count your money so much. And money, they don't even know how business operates, right? So if they, you might hear a nigga made a million dollars. You don't know how the taxes move in that. You don't know the lawyer had to pay to close that deal. You don't know the people I'm paying is running behind me to keep that deal even in a place where I re-up It ain't never about Getting a deal It's the re-up <laughs> Just the same way It ain't never about Serving me once That ain't hitting on nothing I need to become Your customer Nigga yeah. Your money need to come my way Every yeah. time you get some money Bring that my way And it's like When we don't understand that We, we have a problem But I think People who really hustle You can see it in their texture Like yeah. P Like baby mm -hmm. Like certain people You be like yo Like even Gucci mm -hmm. He run and grab niggas From all across mm -hmm. the country And he he literally, I'm he jumping know, on your shit, icing you down, getting out your way. I'm going to tell you why Gucci do that, because he know at the end of the day, that's all I needed. Right. You know what I'm saying? I ain't need nothing but a shot. Yeah. So, Gucci going in slog getting niggas. He ain't trying to go sign nah. niggas. You know what I'm saying? He trying to go help niggas. That's the same shit. It's like, I know I needed that same help. Right. You get what I'm saying? That's like, like I said, like certain niggas, when I take it back from the beginning, when I was saying like different type niggas. Different type niggas came, uh, got it different ways and came from different situations, but they don't mean they can't have the same heart in the end. You get what I'm saying? Like, let's say, Vince, Gucci came out saying he was a taker, right? On his music. Yeah, 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 yeah. Say, we finesse. Yeah, yeah. But that don't mean I can't give with the same heart as a nigga who all he did was hustle. Because now we both that came out of, out of, out of, you know what I'm saying? Out of poverty. Okay? Right. We done both came out and able to help. Right. The niggas who was taken be the niggas who helped the most. Right. Because they really paying back their sins, they feel like, too. Where it be like, 
Yo, I done done some crazy shit, like, and I know what it's like, like you said earlier, too. I really can identify with what it's like being down now off up in the ghetto, yes. kicking that kind of shit, living like that. Yeah. And like you say, I needed a nigga to throw that, throw that motherfucker in the water and reel a nigga in, help a nigga get out of this shit and dry off. See, that's another thing. It's a two-step process. <laughs> These niggas help a nigga get out the water, then dry a nigga off, hand a nigga a towel. See, sometimes they'll just hip, hip you get out the water, leave you right there. Still dripping. That's how you end up jumping back in. No, I think that shit different. I think these niggas wait till you get out the water and then try to help you dry when you already dry. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But that's the game. name of this game. But so. that ain't the game Gucci playing. Oh, Gucci, the hell no. That's what I'm saying. Gucci, Gucci throwing you out, that. Help you out the way and ride yeah, out with you. Yeah, nah, yeah, yeah. He that. Yeah. He that. He yeah. He one to one. He yeah. Did. But there's a, there is a, it's a larger group of niggas that you got to get out the pool for they even consider you. Well, you got to be dry. You got to yeah. have lotion on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For they you even consider you. Nigga, that's how, but I respect the game. Yeah, nah, the game. You, know you can't do nothing but respect it. You can't cry about the winner. You need a coat. Exactly. Cry all you want. You need a coat, home need a coat. boy. You go get that one. Man, are you going to suffer? I think my biggest gift is, and I just realized this shit, is being able to put myself in anybody's shoes. Like, you know what I'm saying? Be able to see any side of anything. Like, and that's hard for a lot of people to do. Yeah. Certain people can't see the side. Like, we were talking earlier. You were like, you say, goddamn. Like, you know the spin game. Yeah. So if a nigga trying to spin you, it makes you feel away. Yeah. Right. Okay. Are you right? But you still, I know a nigga could take a spinning and it don't be a spinning. And too. And I could be going through all shit. I could really want to do this shit, but I ain't ready. Then say that. Then niggas don't know how to communicate either. Then that make you a sucker to me. But how? Because you learn how, how to communicate. Now, because I come up where if you don't communicate, it's gonna be something. Oh, you gotta learn how to talk, but my you nigga. You learn how to do that. You bro. got to. You did. Yeah. A lot of niggas ain't learn how to do a lot of shit. You learn how to do. Yeah, but like, I'm saying. I'm just learning today. That I come in like, damn, nigga, we don't need all these folks out there. Yeah, yeah. I'm just not learning. This. Yeah, yeah. So me spending my five, ten thousand episode, whatever, I spend a yeah. shot thinking niggas doing something. Don't make me a sucker Cause I don't nah, know Nah that's different That's information based You didn't have to know that To claim what you claim Meaning All these guys are positioning themselves Like they come from well, a, a certain lot, background well, We just talked about that Lou We just talked about that You come from Where codes and shit matter Yeah A lot of these niggas came from a different side of Everybody got their own opinion of what real is Yeah But I just so want you to tell you, If I come tell you I'm a real nigga Lou and you tell me, and you tell me you're a real nigga. If I do some shit, that you feel like, nah, that ain't real. Yeah. Us, you would bred it different, real. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. That don't make me no sucker, cause I. Nah, can... But I want you to be who you say you are. What, what That's I say it. I so what if I a say nigga, I, if a you nigga, you put your own meaning, not me. Nah. Okay. If a we nigga, tell, me and you here. Yeah. Devil, yeah, of course, of course. But real nigga is this though, right? So if you're a real nigga, I ain't. I'm high level game. So I don't even accept them kind of quotes. That shit don't even resonate. I digs into that. Yeah. I'm watching that. I yeah. watch niggas. I don't, I don't even listen to niggas. Yeah. Yeah. Right? So I'm saying the way you moving, I'm saying, damn, I might be dealing with undiscovered actors. Right? Because the way you moving and certain things you doing, I'm saying, damn, it look like he might be a real nigga. Yeah. But then so, but you ain't learn how to communicate, right? Well, yeah. man, this nigga not only a nigga, nigga might just be a nigga that lack communication. Why can't you? Why? Why you can't communicate with a nigga, homie? You don't got nothing to lose by that. If I don't want to do something, what you gonna do? Kill I can't me? Say I don't want to do it. Listen, I might want to do it. I Hold can't on. do it right now. I ain't doing it right now. Give me a, a month. Like I'm saying, the yeah, spin move yeah, come yeah. for the spin yeah. move is I ain't really saying nothing. So let me ask you something. You ain't never been in a situation where you want to do some shit, but it just keeps. I'm it. telling a nigga. How? Tell him what? I'm not doing it right now. I could be telling him I'm on the way. If it hit me, I ain't doing it. I'm calling him while he's set up that's down there. That's real. That's real. I'm that's not, that's I'm real. not living that's like real. that. That's I ain't scared real. of that. What that's you going to kill yeah, me because I say I don't want to do it? But, and, what a, but you got some niggas, bro. This is like, how you activate. That. Nah, this is how you activate. I'm going keep it real with you, bro. But, but let me keep I, it real I, with I you. Need, that's why I don't deal with niggas. Niggas got to call me to, to do my shit. They, but that's what I'm telling you. These niggas calling me. This what make it, this what make, Man, I ain't cold. calling no nigga. That's cold, that's cold right now. That's what I'm telling you, I don't never hit a nigga about nothing. Yeah. So when you reach out to me and then you try to pull some kind of, it's some, it's some Skittles in there too, you want some? Then you call me and you try to pull some kind of, what is? But at the end of the day though, bro, this is a, 
And then hit ain't listen. the game of real niggas. No, nah, but I'm this saying, is. If they indicate all of us will have a billion dollars already. Yeah, but That's these. What I'm but, this is the game of suckers. So if we don't learn how to play that game. We lose. We lose. But here's the thing about the and, sucker game. How, no, but you ain't got to play the sucker game. Just sit back and fuck with what fuck with you. So you That's all I'm going to do in, anyway. So, you, so listen, when the dude, whoever that was, what you told him, we ain't yeah, going to call no name. Yeah. He called you and said whatever he said. Your first initiative was he was a sucker. Yes. Before y'all even had to come yes. before he said he won't yes. do it. So when he said he want to do it. I gotta know that this is soccer. Yeah, that ain't better. You right about this. <laughs> yeah, you right about that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I yeah, know you right about sucker. that. You right about that. You right about that. You told me you was a real now. I'm gonna say you. Uh, but, but yeah, you right about that. That's the trick bag. You right about that. But here's the. I think. I think. I want to believe. I want to <laughs> trust shit. Like you said, we don't believe in nothing. I want to believe these niggas is like me. Man, I already knew. I know that, well, though. I'm go yeah, it's me. the trick bag. It's the <laughs> trick bag. You right about that. Well, the but, but he I go seen you or spoke on you or anything said to you, you I knew you was a sucker. I'm, I'm handling you like a sucker. So when you get around me, now you're a play. I can't take you in as a real nigga no matter what you say. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. So yeah. basically, you let a nigga talk you down Not, for what yeah, you yeah, already yeah. know he was. You're right. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It's like you but mean they, a And you know what? They came with some game, but it take it take big bait, though. Who it, we fought for that, though? Yeah. That's, nah, nah. Sales, I got a little bit to do with that, though. <laughs> I ain't lying. I got something to do with that, though. I bullshit. You right. You right about that. But guess what, though? I think even what's more, what's even more important is this how you activate beef and haters in your neighborhood. Because I'm going to be all right. I didn't even call you niggas to begin with. I'm going to be Facts. straight, homie. Facts, bro. If I'm lying, God can strike everything I love down. I ain't called no nigga. Right? right? But here's, here's the key. key. This how you activate problems. When you making promises, even this is what I know niggas doing in their neighborhoods. See, Loon don't need no nigga no way. But this is how these niggas activating issues. They going through the neighborhood and they saying shit. shit now I got you, homie. Now for sure. Now, now I'm, I'm in with, with that business. business. Now I got, got you, bro. I'm in my hood keeping it real. If I can't help, if I can't do it right now, I can't do it. Right. And I'm saying but that, that but it breeds because I know what it lead to. But it lead to problems. Let me, let me say this, though, no. That's you, and that's solid to the core. But the thing about this game that you're in now, is no morals in it. You're right. The nigga, don't, nigga don't give a fuck. Nigga hide from you. These niggas right. gotta hide. Yeah, well, they, they hide like a motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck you, basically. Yeah, I'm yeah. See yeah, you. yeah. So, nigga, but when I see you, you catch me, then I might keep it real yeah. that day. Yeah, yeah. Or say what need to be said in the moment. Yeah, come on, man. I man. ain't even run. Fuck that nigga. I don't even want them niggas on. It's <laughs> over for that now. No, I'm just but I ain't even. But why though? Because that I don't need your shit. No, it don't. Listen, I'm gonna be all right. Taking this shit. No, you gonna be all right. Yeah. You taking it personal. Get a nigga on here. Once you get in and sit in, I'm gonna ask you that. That's Damn, bro, why you spending? Facts. Facts. Like, let's have that conversation because I feel like yeah. that wasn't no real yeah, shit yeah, that yeah. you could have been communicated. Yeah. So I'm going to let that shit just... And I never needed you, brother. I didn't reach out to you. That's what kind of sucker you shit? You're you right about that. Accountability. You're right about that. You're <laughs> right about that. Hey, man, I better let you make it. Don't count on you. Yeah. Hey, let's get the business done. Yeah. Yeah. Good business. But, but uh, it ain't even. I see it. My thing is how I'm in the market is fuck these niggas and their relationships. Like, I ain't never been a nigga to even say, I ain't got no co hosts. I ain't took. From no nigga where they make them my partner forever, none of that. I come in, I own 100% of it. But you ain't under, I get what you're saying, though. So, I'm just trying to give you something. Yeah, no, nah, this is good you, game even for people for watching. Too. Yeah. The thing about it, I get a lot for you. I watch your shit, nigga. I reached out to you. Folks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah. Hard. You was one of the, you was the first nigga that, that posted that shit, said, This nigga here inspired me, boy. Yeah, for real, from, the from behind you, though. Yeah. And I, I, I I'm talking about just it. even in podcasting, like y'all already established. I'm cranking up. I just saw it. Yeah. I, this ain't no shit nobody sent me. Yeah. Explore page. I saw this shit starting like, oh my God, what it was. You talk about so I think it was some dog shit. Yeah. I was like, boy, this nigga hit hard. Yeah. The way you were dropping them bombs and doing all yeah. this shit, I like this nigga hard and close. Yeah. And some kind of way we got yeah, all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Organic. That was I don't off know the real. Nothing about, I ain't know what city you from. Yeah. Ain't no shit. That's real. I'm just being one. Yeah. I just know this shit hard. That's how music shit that I post. It catch me, I'm fucking with it. I don't give a fuck who you who op you is, yeah. whatever. I fuck with right. it. Right. I can't deny something. What I'm trying to tell you is you don't want the way you feel about a sucker ass nigga to, to affect other, the being. To, to affect motherfucker that wanna fuck with you, but they see. Now you got on the shoe that the sucker don't put on you. How? Nigga, listen, listen, let me okay, go ahead. Right Just say Vincent. If you felt the way about me and you telling the real truth, that nigga bank a sucker, that nigga this, that nigga that. 
but I already got my face yeah. on bait. Yeah. I'm going around telling nigga that I know white right, will fuck with you because you're a real nigga. I know you're a real nigga. Yeah. I'm telling nigga, man, nigga, man, that nigga mad because of this. Yeah. Man. That nigga don't know how to do business in this guy. Yeah. Now, niggas, that what the fuck with you for real going to share away because I'm listening to this sucker and you fitting the shoes by speaking on it. Right, right. That's why I don't speak on it. That's <laughs> why I ain't, but, but I told you then. The, the reason why I ain't speaking on it Because I think it's a trick bag If it ain't a muzzle It's a trick bag It's a Do that Then activate you in the market To look like a hater or something I, I, You know yes. what I'm saying And that's why I'm, I'm, I'm peeping yes. this low level yes. So I'm saying Damn is this a What the fuck Why would a nigga reach out to me What's this about It sound like a trick bag But but like what I'm See it through Exactly that mean, I'm just gonna see it Yeah through. yeah see how they play And that's what I've been doing yeah, I just brought it to you Because you want a man So it's like Man, look, this. Yeah. You know what I mean? What but you is don't want that energy out there? What nah. Are, what, are you, what you know? What I'm saying anybody could feel like you. Feel, like I ain't trying to tell them nigga how to be. Yeah. Cause I'm fuck these niggas. Yeah, too. yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, whether you fuck me, you fuck me. That's yeah, what it is. Yeah. That's what it is. Yeah. Right, go. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, you don't want to put on the shoes that a nigga done lay stuff for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's hard for him though. This why I bank for me in particular because my shit's so potent and I kick that business information knowledge shit. Yeah. So every time they try to put me in the messy bag and a nigga come check me out, he's saying, oh, man, that nigga kicking some shit though. Y'all nah, hear that? Nah, yeah, I hear you, bro, but I, they might not like nothing, but they know him. But I'm gonna sit and watch this though. Yeah. See what's going on with this nigga, cause he kicking some shit. And I know what you saying about him, but I don't know if it's but I don't think they can put that cause I ain't I ain't doing no sucker shit. I ain't never done no nah, sucker it's shit. The codes that you stand on, it's the code we just talked about this, the codes and the wars you stand on. Yeah. So the shit that you stand on. It you gonna look at, suckerish. You looking at listen, you the same way. You know where you come from. You know the shit you spin is coming from your heart. Yeah. Right? And you seeing the other podcasts, other people doing shit and look like them nigga, man, them nigga really mislead yeah, yeah. some bitch. Yeah, yeah. So because they don't come from where you come from, they don't really say shit. I just said, if a nigga was out here getting money and a nigga was broke taking money, we look at them, it's different. Like them niggas ain't like Nah, us. the nigga that taking money don't got no, no business speaking on the brick price. He don't got no business talking about what the hustler everyday life is. And that's the thing in this podcast game. Even if I do look at a nigga and say, yeah. man, what these nigga doing? Why he even talking about robbing and he ain't never took nothing? Yeah. It don't make sense to that's what it, the, it ain't about. The, the coach as a whole is specifically what you nigga speaking but about. The information is plentiful. Yeah, but it, but it, is misinformation never, is too. But I never, I never got down. I never had lost a hundred pound before. Yeah. But I was speaking like I, that's what I want to do. Yeah, but have you been in the game to know what it's like to lose a hundred pounds? Have you been next to that's a nigga that pound weight? Like, yeah. Oh, okay, weight okay, weight. okay, 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 like, okay, I, like, okay. Like, like, and yeah, right yeah, yeah. A lot of niggas but you wasn't speaking me. on that. You yeah, wasn't out. You wasn't out as the authority of that before this. Thank you. But a lot of niggas be trying to get me. Even when I when I first first looted, like, bang, we gotta start telling these people, bro. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just doing what nigga telling me to do. So I be a damn fool to be out here trying to sell some junk. Yeah, it's a trick line. bag. That's yeah, why, yeah. That's why I link up with my nigga uh, Red from Wait No More. You know what I'm saying? His nigga got a whole gym, twenty goddamn um to ten to twenty goddamn. Uh, trainers and uh, teachers Damn. and coaches. So when I do the hiker bank, hiker bank just me out there, y'all really hiker bank. We got people like real people, fitness people. Yeah. Like, hey, you can join a gym, you can do whatever. These folks make sure you get up the mountain, make sure you breathe the right. I can't look at the nigga telling he breathing gonna fall out. So I'm, that's why you But see okay then So you telling me that I'm right Because you ain't got no idea That's what I'm saying So the Well this is how they confuse the market though Whoa Thank you guys so much for watching this Episode of It's Up There Podcast If you just need more loan I need you to come to Patreon.com It's Up There Podcast Link is below me It tells me that a high percentage 75% of people that's watching my videos Are not subscribed I'm asking you guys to subscribe to the channel Make sure you keep up with every episode we drop While all these other podcasts are dying out We feel like we just now are catching stride So we appreciate everyone that's watching We got more live events coming And in part 2 of this It gets very spicy me and Bank break down some things that I think the whole industry needs to hear. It's up there, podcast. I'll see you soon.